Okay, continuing with getting to know open position, now what you're going to do is you're going to make yourself find the different letters. So you're going to say F and find the two Fs, and then C, find the two Cs. A, A, G, D, there's actually only one D, you know, E, like that. And you want to test yourself to be able to find any of those seven letters. And then the last thing you'll do is you go, okay, what notes are on the third fret? I have a G, I have a C, I have an F. What notes are on the first fret? Well, there's just an F. What are the open notes? E, A, D, G, right? What's the second fret? Well, I have a B, I have an E, I have an A, I've got a B on the fourth fret, and I've got a C on the fifth fret. And it doesn't hurt to get to know these fifth fret notes too, because that's gonna be part of the next step, right? And you have A, D, G, C. So that's the next skill you want to get. So when you put this all together, you have being able to play all the notes of open C, being able to find any of the individual letters between zero and the fifth fret, and then being able to know what note is on each of those frets. And you do that with the natural notes, and when you get really good at that, you can start testing yourself with sharps and flats.